Now, if you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're gonna need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. Telling them, keep your pants on. All right, this next test may involve trace amounts of time travel. So, word of advice, if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time, entirely, forward and backward. So, do both of yourselves a favor and just let that handsome devil go about his business. between tests. The lab boys say that might be a fear reaction. I'm no psychiatrist, but coming from a bunch of eggheads who wouldn't recognize the thrill of danger if it walked up and snapped their little pink bras, that sounds like projection. They didn't fly into space, storm a beach, or bring back the gold. No, sir, we did. It's you and me against the world, son. I like your grit. Hustle could use some work, though. No. Now let's solve this thing.
science isn't about why, it's about why not. Why is so much of our science dangerous? Why not marry safe science if you love it so much? In fact, why not invent a special safety door that won't hit you on the butt on the way out because you are fired? Now you test subject, you're doing fine. Yes, you, box your stuff out the front door, parking lot, car, goodbye.